Hello, and thanks for tuning in. We are still doing some work on the feet. So another exercise that can really help increase mobility in the feet and strengthen the muscles and the arches and um, can help alleviate um, bunions or maybe even prevent them altogether is working the toes um, in, a, in a way that gives them a little extra, um, extra movement. And what we're gonna do today is just take a wash rag and put it down on the floor. And then with your foot, you're going to start trying to scooch that wash rag toward your foot. And I don't know if you can see it very well or not, but the wash rag is kind of, is coming together. It's scrunching up. This works the best on a wooden floor or linoleum, something that is not as grippy as carpet or a yoga mat. But then, so you wanna scooch it towards you, use those toes, and then once you've done that, then you work to push it away. And you push and you push and you push until you can unfold that towel or the or wash rag. So it's, um, it's really nice to do that a few times just to get those muscles in the foot working, gives them a little extra, um, extra mobility, extra strength. So again, we'll switch sides. You want that wash rag and ideally you just start ripping with the toes until it folds up. And if you can get it to come all the way up, then you do that, and then once it's crunched all the way in, then you start pushing it away with those toes. And it works the muscles in the top of the foot, it works the muscles in your shins, and even around your ankles. So it's another good way to take care of your feet. Again, try it on a floor that is slick, you know, wood floor, linoleum, tiles, something um, a little more conducive to it than what I'm doing on the carpet. But what you're going for is you have your rag and then as your foot works on it, it's going to start scrunching that rag up, almost like a little bow tie effect. And then you're going to push it away so that it's flat again. Hope this helps. Hope you can implement it into your routine. And if you do, let me know. I'd love to hear your results. Until next time.